Saudi warplanes have mistakenly targeted positions belonging to the loyalists of the former Yemeni regime in the country's south. Their airstrikes killed at least 12 remnants of the former regime and injured 30 others in the province of Lahij. Meanwhile, Riyadh has violated a self-declared humanitarian pause on the first day of its implementation. Saudi warplanes have targeted various areas in the provinces of Sada, Haja, and Aden. At least three people were killed in airstrikes on the provinces of Haja and Sada. Saudi Arabia's onslaught has claimed nearly 4,900 lives since it started in late March. Hussein Abu Khaiti is an activist and political commentator joining us from uh, Yemen's capital, Sana. Well, Hussein Abu Khaiti, here you have a case where uh, you got some of the Hadi loyalists who have been killed. Uh, what do we have here? About 30 of them? I'm not too sure what the uh, number was. But in, in any case, it shows perhaps maybe that even the intelligence that Saudi Arabia has regarding positions is incorrect, which shows perhaps then how many innocent people they have killed if they can't even tell them apart at this point. Yeah, I mean, this attack today that on their uh, loyalist uh, in Lahja, south of Yemen, just show you uh, uh, the intelligence that the Saudi gather uh, uh, for uh, their uh, strikes in Yemen. And th this is why we have this high uh, casualty in civilians, uh, because uh, mainly they, they, they depend sometimes on social media uh, to target uh, areas in Yemen. Whoever posted something about a building or about a street or about an area that it have a present of, uh, for example, uh, Houthi uh, Popular Committee fighters or Yemeni army, the Saudi straight away go and target that area. And today they have targeted uh, uh, a group of their loyalists while they were uh, uh, at the beginning of launching an attack on Yemeni army position in Lahj. And uh, they killed uh, uh, over uh, f uh, 40 people, as the latest uh, I got uh, before I uh, appear on your TV. And uh, as well, if you remember that two days ago, they have uh, targeted uh, uh, an entire uh, complex of uh, worker at uh, Mocha uh, power plant, uh, killing about 70 and injuring over 100. And uh, they are the one who uh, announced this uh, uh, so-called uh, ceasefire. And they are the one who violated in the, in the first half an hour uh, today, at the early hour uh, of today, they have targeted a medical center in Lahj, killing one person and injuring uh, several people, uh, including medical staff. Thank you for that. Hossein Abukhazi, activist and political commentator from Sana.